weather. All right, today is a first alert weather day. We are shaking up the weather pattern to what we have felt Monday and Tuesday. It's going to feel completely different here on this Wednesday, and that is the reason why we have carried over this first alert weather day for this Wednesday. But we are going to alert you to the potential for even a few snowflakes that could be flying. You notice just off to our west, we're completely quiet here locally at home, but just up to our north and west, you notice some blues showing on up here. We're going to switch our wind direction for today out of the north and west, and we may have a few snowflakes flying into the air as we go throughout the morning commute. Uh, so right now there's absolutely no snow, really no issues out on the roadways except the wind. You're going to need two hands on the wheel as you're out driving on this Wednesday as we are alerting you to some wind gusts later on today, upwards of around 40 miles per hour. But check out this map here as we go throughout the early portion here of this Wednesday past sunrise through about the noon hour. Can't rule out maybe a trace, maybe upwards of around a half inch of snow, mainly north of the US 20 bypass. Most roads should stay just wet, but we can't rule out maybe one or two little quick ice patches that could develop on one or two bridges or roadways, and that's all due to this temperature crash. You're going to notice this here in the future track, and this is what you need to pay attention to as we go throughout the morning hours here. Here we are paused about two hours from now at 7 a.m. Notice how our actual air temperature is staying still just above freezing, but watch how quickly we go. As we get closer towards the noon hour, these temperatures crash way down. We're going to be down below freezing with area-wide temperatures into the 20s by the noon hour. And I'll even have to contend with, again, a few very light snow showers rolling on through a first alert weather feature track as we walk you through this uh, first half of this Wednesday. And then by late in the day, we're going to want to alert you to some sunshine that could be returning. That'll be a little bit of a mood booster trying to head our way with this cold weather that is in store for this Wednesday. Wind again is going to be an issue. Here's a look at our current wind gust right now, gusting 20 to 30 miles per hour. And later on today, this is what I want you to pay attention to in first alert weather. We're going to have the wind to contend with all day long. And by the lunchtime hour, wouldn't it be surprised if we get some wind gusts that could be upwards of around 40 miles per hour. So again, it's going to be kind of that two hands on the wheel type of driving headed our way as we roll on on into this Wednesday. First alert 10 day. If you don't like this brief return to winter, well, luckily again, I just used the word brief there as by Wednesday or Thursday. That is we're back up into the 40s late in the day with sunshine headed our way 50s by Friday. And in fact, for the weekend could be looking at 60s, maybe a run at near 70. Here's wow. something I'm really glad you're doing. You're telling people, OK, the temperatures that you're seeing outside right now are not what you dress for today, right? Don't dress the bottom right hand corner of your screen. I'm looking at it right now. It says 41 degrees. Don't Do dress for that. Even you're going to be in trouble because it. Nope. That. it that wind chill <laughs> is going to slap you in the face. Silly. Yeah. Got it? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Later today. Brain freeze. Today. Yep. Got it. That's good. All right. Thank you. But point taken. All right. Coming up this morning at 530, the Michigan primary results are in. Who came out on top?